Here we see the wild cave wetter. It's so disgusting that the Māori name translates into God of Ugly Things in English. He is alone because it's winter and wet is split up during the winter time to look for food after mating with other wetters during the summer season. The cold doesn't bother the wetter. In fact, it can survive 17 days at minus 10 degrees Celsius temperatures if it stays in suspension. This is because wetters have natural antifreeze in their blood, compared to the lame cockroach that dies at minus 9 degrees Celsius. So the only thing it has to be concerned about is food during the winter time. As you can see, the sweater is missing one of its long back legs used for jumping. We have no idea what could have done this, because the main predators of the wetter are bats and reptiles, but none of those live under our house where I found them. Maybe a bigger wetter? The wetter is also known to be one of the largest insects in the world. On average, they are 100 millimeters big, over double the size of the average cockroach, which is only 35 to 41 millimeters big. A really big one can be the size of a gerbil. The wetter actually starts moving around, and we tried to stop it from escaping into the bush where it'll never be seen again. Then the wetter runs at me and tries to kill me. It's unlikely the wetter will ever go extinct in New Zealand because it's a resourceful critter that's hard to get rid of, like the cockroach, but it's better because it doesn't freeze. <laughs>